Well, it is no secret this pandemic has caused many people to feel isolated and distressed. And one local organization has set up a COVID-19 coping hotline with operators on standby ready to talk. 17's Perla Shaheen tells us more about what they're doing. Perla? Yes, the Latino COVID task force has worked since the beginning of the pandemic to support rural committees in Kern County. Now they've set up a hotline to bring comfort to anyone who needs it. It's an idea so beneficial that Vice President-elect Kamala Harris wants to expand it nationally. Stay-at-home orders and shutdowns have caused many people to feel alone. According to the CDC, more than 40% of adults in the U.S. say the pandemic has seriously impacted their mental health. We want people to feel like they can, they can call us, they have somebody to talk to, we have mental health experts. The Latino COVID Task Force has set up COVID testing sites and resources to benefit Kern County during this pandemic. Now, president of the task force, Jay Tamsey, is taking it a step further with a COVID coping hotline. We've really seen folks call in who are depressed, who are fearful, who have anxiety, and they just need somebody to talk to, and that's what we're here for. It gives people in Kern County a direct line to call for resources or emotional support. It is not a 1-800 number, a 1-8 number. It is a 661 number that we selected as a task force. We wanted folks in Kern County to know that we are here for them, that we want them to call into a local number. You'll get people that will answer the phones, not an answering machine. Kern County Latino COVID-19 hotline, how may I help you? Tamzi and his team launched this hotline in the middle of December. It's already received more than 800 calls. We give out some resources within the community, whether it um, can be testing sites or if they have financial issues with um, their employer or if they have questions about food stamps, um, anything like that, we can help um, aid them in whatever they need. Once you dial the hotline, one of three trained operators will answer the call on their cell phone. They answer nonstop Monday through Friday from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. Even if you call after hours, an operator will call you back within 24 hours. The hotline also offers optional 30-minute phone calls with certified counselors for anyone who needs additional help. I always get the question, am I crazy? And it's like, no, you're not. You just need to talk, you know. You need to talk and work out these, these issues. And so from um, uh, stuff like that, I do refer them to the counselor as well for like a deeper conversation. Vice President-elect Kamala Harris heard about this hotline and the work of the task force. Tamsi spoke with her chief of staff to discuss mirroring his organization on a national level. We were able to um, to flesh all those ideas out to her to her staff, and um, she was very impressed. Uh, Senator Harris was very impressed by what we had to say, and uh, we hope to see a United States Latino task force. The hotline's number is six six one. 525-5900. We'll have that number and more resources for getting help on our website at kget.com. Perla Shaheen, 17 News.